Hello, and in today's 5 Minute Friday, we're going to focus on a group of people that perform tower inspections. I know several people that have been looking at the Mavic 3 Enterprise and thinking that they would like to have that better camera and the extended battery life, but have been unable to purchase one because a DJI chose to hobble a number of the features. So I want to show you how you can get around that by using drone links on the fly orbit function to perform the typical orbit around a tower. I'm going to cheat and use this church steeple as a proxy for a tower, but I think you'll see that the same rules apply, which is that you can set the center of the orbit and you can adjust your altitude, the center point and the radius all as you fly and as you would normally do when you're flying towers. So how do we do that? You start by entering the on the fly orbit function and then flying above the tower that you'll be interested in, looking straight down. There's a nice little target icon that helps you identify the center so you can easily mark the center of the tower. You then press the mark button. Once you've done that, you fly away from the tower to set your initial radius. You can do this, you just take your time, you can adjust the altitude, you can adjust your, your gimbal angle and then you press mark again once you're in the right position. Press next and you'll be asked if you want to include options to change the direction and speed etc and you're going to select yes and hit next again. Then activate the RC sticks I think you'll agree the answer is yes and your initial direction clockwise or counterclockwise. We're going to go clockwise. How fast do you want the drone to orbit? I set it to 3 mile per hour and the gimbal pitch. So for this you want to use the current pitch as we're going to want to be able to adjust this while we're flying. So select current pitch and hit next. Pick your media type. I'd already selected a 10 second interval photo so I've selected photo. You'll get a screen that asks you to confirm all of the options that you've set up and at this screen you have the chance to go back and make any adjustments. Once you've done that, you hit start, there'll Three, be a countdown, two, and one, then the starting drone mode. will start to orbit. I think what you'll be able to see is that straight away you've got a, a, a nice orbit around the center point. But as usual, if you look at the bottom of the screen, we can use the left stick to descend or ascend just by moving the left stick up and down. When doing this, you can also adjust the gimbal to keep whatever it is that you need in focus. If the center of the tower starts to drift left or right, you can also use the sticks to correct for that as you go. And should you wish to get closer or further away, again, just use the sticks. Um, there's actually an item if you're looking at it on the left hand side where the uh, the drone is orbiting and it'll actually show you two icons. One is where the drone is and one is where it's going to be after your adjustments and that can be quite useful. And that's basically all there is to it. Now you can just keep circling taking photos until you've got all of the items captured that you need and hopefully this gives you the ability now to go out purchase the drone that you actually really want to purchase and save yourself hours of battery swapping. Anyway, that's it for today. As always, I love to hear your comments, so feel free to leave a comment and I'll see you next time.